Okay, just at number five, Avonell Street, just going to have a look at this um, sewer drain, see if we can see what's been causing the issues. So, uh, just in the, the carport here at the moment, just going to drop through this leak. Come down, hopefully get all the way to the main sewer, but we'll see what's in the way. So that land's a bit fogged up at the moment. Uh, just a bit of greasy sort of water in that gully. See if we can get it cleaned down there somewhere and have a better look on the way back. Okay, that looks like a jump up. Okay, so that's like a jump up type fit in there. Um, let's see if we've got any other access to it, but she's not very long. So that was pretty good, the back corner of the house. Um, I'd say she's a bit blurry there at the moment. But you can see enough to see that there's nothing wrong with that section of the pipe. Accesses around the back and more part to check out. Okay, so I've just been all around the house and checked everything else out. Um, there's no other underground drains, they're all at this side, so we've pretty much been through the length of them. Uh, but what I did see while I was around there, this pipe here leads back to the kitchen. Um, it looks a bit more, it's got a, a sag in it, so that's probably causing some issues. Let's see if we can get the camera to go back up that way. So this is heading back up a little 50 mil pipe back towards the kitchen sink. So you can see she's holding water. Because the pipe's sort of got a big sag or a belly in it, it just needs clipping up a bit better to the underside of the house. So you can just sort of see some greasy fatty deposits on there which are always to get from a kitchen sink but obviously where the pipe holds water like this is where it's all going to gather and that's the elbow there where it goes around and into the kitchen into the sink through the wall
side so it pretty much holds water sort of up and down all the way so that probably was causing the issues so back out of the water there and then drop back in again so if we take those bellies out of the pot it should be pretty right Get under there and do it, but I'm sure it can be done.